All right, spring is spring, and with that comes picnics, fresh blooms, and more. Uh, a local spot is celebrating a very special second anniversary. So Sacra Gray is there checking it all out this morning. Hi, Sacra. Hi, good morning, guys. So when we think about hosting a brunch or a picnic, it's all about the little touches that can really make that event special. So that's why we're joining the Little Touches out here this morning, and they have set up this beautiful tablescape for us right now. As you can see, the candles are lit, the seating is set, and at, down to every little detail, they are the ones that are gonna plan and prepare everything for you. So if you have an event coming up where you want to meet up with all of your gal pals they have got you covered i'm joined here with geneva first off congratulations on thank the two-year anniversary thank you so much thank you yeah so you have accomplished so much in this two years and what's really exciting right now is the weather hopefully is warming up a little bit <laughs> spring is springing so picnic season is here tell us about what you guys do for picnics what we do is we basically do picnics for um it could be birthday parties it could be mother's day it could be just you with your girls, and you just wanted to go outside and enjoy yourself, and we have charcuterie boards. You guys can sit, talk, play games, and do stuff like that, so. It's really giving an elevated touch to your typical picnic. This was not the picnic that I grew up with, but it definitely <laughs> gives that upscale vibe, and also, you know, you can have photo backgrounds as well yes. to make it an Instagram-worthy event. So tell us a little bit about how you put everything together right here. Well, I just went with a color scheme, and pink is the color for Mother's Day this season. Yes. So I just kind of played with some colors, um, and I chose, and that's kind of like, oh, actually, my inspiration was the glasses. So the glasses is actually pink and orange, mm. and I said, let me put a tablescape around the glasses. So speaking of Mother's Day, right now you guys are doing bookings for any picnic setups that you guys may want to book for Mother's Day. This is every mom's dream come true, yeah. right? You sit, you get to enjoy the beautiful flowers, and then hopefully have some good food as well. Yes, you can definitely, This you can do it indoors, you can do it outdoors, you can do it anywhere. Um, they have a beautiful rose garden in Sacramento, so it, it will be the perfect scene for just hanging out with your friends or doing something to surprise your mom. And so the little touches handles everything. They yes. you just they just have to reach out to you. You handle setting everything up. You handle the cleanup. How did, what does the booking process look like for anybody that's looking at this, saying this is exactly what my mom needs for Mother's Day? What you can do is go onto my Instagram or onto my website and just send a DM, or you can book a package on my website. My website is being updated, so it will be available in the next couple of days. But it is up as well. So you could do that, and once you do that, I will have a phone consultation with you, and you can let me know what colors you like, or if you want to do something that I already have, and let me know how many people, and then we'll go ahead and get you booked and ready to go. Amazing. It's just that easy. So, again, we're giving you guys plenty of heads up for Mother's Day. We know it's April, but May is coming soon, so you want to get everything booked right now. Coming up in the next hour, we'll break down how you could maybe do some setup of your own, talking a little bit about how she's mentoring the next business owners right here in our area as well. So don't go anywhere. We'll have more on the little touches coming right up. It's always the little touches, right? I love it. Thank you, Sacra.